Before ratios were put into law, I had 10 patients by myself on night shift. And I had 10 plus patients. I didn't have enough feet, enough hands to get the work done. The patients are calling and you just can't go to seven, eight people at the same time. After the ratios was achieved in California, they have come back to the profession. I said, if CNA won ratios for the nurses here, I want to be a part of CNA. I was so happy for ratios. It was a godsend. When the ratios came, it was like, hallelujah, because then you were really able to give true patient care. The thing that changed the most was um, quality of care. You know, I, I was able to really devote myself to every single patient. We're able to consult with each other because there are a lot more nurses on the floor and we're able to support each other and we have all these safeguards in place because of ratio. After the ratios went into effect, patients were better educated on how to take their medications when they got home. And it also guarantees the patient that when you come into the hospital, you're going to be taken care of by a registered nurse. And that's a big difference. It gives me the time to look at their chart and look at the doctor's progress notes so I can see the big picture of what's going on with the patient. And I went to this one floor and talked to those nurses. There was two nurses on a floor with over 25 to 30 patients. Patients screaming out in pain. And that's when I knew right then and there, in every state, we got to have ratios. See all the, the great things that ratios bring to nurses and their patients. Fight for it because the patients deserve it. Fight for it because that's why you came into nursing. Our profession speaks for itself because we are the patient's advocate.